A polypoprotein B and cardiovascular disease. A polypoprotein B ApoB is a protein that plays a key role in lipid metabolism and is associated with cardiovascular disease CVD. ApoB is a structural component of lipoproteins, which transport cholesterol and triglycerides in the blood. The two main types of lipoproteins containing ApoB are low density lipoprotein, LDL, and very low density lipoprotein, VLDL. Here are the key points regarding ApoB and its relationship to cardiovascular disease. 1. ApoB and lipoproteins. Each LDL particle contains one molecule of ApoB, making it a useful measure for assessing LDL particle concentration. High levels of ApoB are indicative of an elevated number of atherogenic particles in the bloodstream. 2. Atherogenic lipoproteins. LDL particles are considered atherogenic because, when they infiltrate the arterial wall, they can contribute to the formation of atherosclerotic plaques. These plaques can lead to the narrowing and hardening of arteries, increasing the risk of cardiovascular events. 3. ApoB slash ApoAI ratio. The ratio of ApoB to a polypoprotein AI, ApoAI, which is a component of high density lipoprotein, HDL, is sometimes used as an indicator of cardiovascular risk. A higher ApoB slash ApoAI ratio is associated with an increased risk of coronary artery disease. 4. Non HDL cholesterol. ApoB is considered a more accurate measure of atherogenic particle concentration than traditional cholesterol measurements. Non-HDL cholesterol, which includes LDL cholesterol, is often used as a surrogate marker for ApoB. 5. Association with CVD risk. Elevated levels of ApoB have been associated with an increased risk of cardiovascular events, including heart attacks and strokes. Monitoring ApoB levels may provide additional information beyond traditional lipid profiles for assessing cardiovascular risk. 6. Treatment targets. Some healthcare professionals use ApoB levels as a treatment target for managing cardiovascular risk, especially in individuals with diabetes or metabolic syndrome. 7. Therapeutic considerations. Therapies aimed at reducing ApoB levels often focus on lowering LDL cholesterol through lifestyle modifications, diet and exercise, and medications such as statins. Other lipid-lowering medications may also be considered based on individual risk profiles. It's important to note that while ApoB is a useful marker, it is usually measured in specialized laboratories and may not be included in routine lipid panels. Healthcare professionals typically assess multiple risk factors, including LDL cholesterol, HDL cholesterol, and triglycerides, to evaluate cardiovascular risk comprehensively. Individuals concerned about their cardiovascular health should consult with a healthcare provider for personalized assessments, including lipid profiles and other relevant tests. Lifestyle modifications and, in some cases, medications may be recommended to manage cardiovascular risk factors. Subscribe for more videos.